Hi, my name is Alicia Daniel. I'm a second year graduate student at Wichita State University School of Design, Art, and Creative Industries. And this is my door. I plastered it with indigenous art from Barbados. That's where I'm from. And we have a long history of painting. So that's one of the reasons I got into painting. So from here, I like the use of color that we use. We're really colorful, we're really vibrant people, and we like to express it in art. So from this style of painting, I'm actually incorporating some of the colors into my own work. And I specialize mainly in portraiture. So these are all portraits of people I've met since I've been in Kansas. And it so happens that they all happen to be from different countries as well. I kind of like that concept of displacement for the fact that it kind of channels me into figuring out my own place in terms of being from a different country and living in another and learning how to adapt into a different space. So that is actually Tien, he's another art student. And we are actually doing a project together based on the fact of displacement and globalization. And it's called Breaking Borders. And we're doing, a, we're actually going to the Mexico-United States border to try to raise awareness on why borders are, just didn't exist anymore. They're, they're something of the past. They need to be something that we need to get rid of to move on to the future. So coming from a different country, I, I understood a little bit about borders and how it was hard to even you know, navigate into a different space and being a, a different person. So me and Tian are going to the U.S.-Mexico border and we're going to, Tian is going to make a dust ball. It's an ancient Japanese technique. And I will be documenting his process because I'm very interested in how people are dealing with the politics in this country, how they are able to navigate being who they are from different places and just being involved in this country basically. And so from this stuff, I'm actually dealing a lot with, this is my new project. His name is, I can never pronounce it right. It's E, he just wants me to call him E. He is actually from Eritrea, which is a country in Africa I had never heard of until I met him. And I usually meet um, what I call expatriates, people from different countries in the weirdest ways. He was my taxi driver. And, you know, in certain countries in Africa, the idea of color is really important to their culture. And he seemed like a really colorful personality. That's one of the reasons I've painted him in so many colors. Um, and this is Tian. I'm still working with creating art about our collaboration. Because it's really important to us that we just kind of raise we keep raising awareness about this issue, about globalization, about being kind of othered in terms of how we navigate in this country. So I'm doing woodcuts now, dealing with his face. Just dealing with his face and different techniques that we use in printmaking, which are kind of also techniques that we used in the Caribbean. So I'm combining the two. It's all about globalization and just bringing countries together.